the thing is this. It's the situation. I remember when I got out of prison, the guard said he'll see me again. Oh, right. And I was like, who is he talking to? Like, that's what you think? Like sarcastically? Or no, like he, that's what he's did. He's like, no, I'll see you soon. I don't I can't. This is what I never do. I don't I don't assume how somebody says I just listen to what they're saying. Mm-hmm. Like it the statement is, I will see you again. Hmm. That's I don't care if he was saying it nice. Okay, the statement is the words that I'm listening to. You took the words. I at will face see value. you again. That means he think that I'm coming back to prison. That's this that's clear. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, oh, okay. If that's what you think. And the anger, but it's not my anger is never misplaced energy. Like I place the energy with so now my focus is I'll show you that you are you will see me again, but you won't see me in this place. You'll see me in a successful place. Yeah, you'll see me on TV. You know, not even knowing if it was gonna be TV or not, but you will see me again when you see me. Mm-hmm. It will be in a, from a successful space. I hope you remember that shit you said. How many years ago was that story? Did that happen? When I got out of prison in, in 1997. So that still motivates you. Like you you don't just like randomly think like that's the story. You reach out and that's in your bucket ready to go. No, nah, it's, it's several. Anytime anybody gives me, puts me in a box mm-hmm. and thinks that that's where I'm at. I'm like, oh, okay. And the, I, man, it's, you're not going to be a good father. It, 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 the, whatever yeah. the statement is, like, I remember God told me that he was, as a stand-up, that he was the same as me. I was like, mm. I, I was like, how so? He was like, man, I've done everything you've done. And in my mind, I'm like, you fucking crazy. Like, you nowhere close to me. And, I, and I'm a person who never say any of my accolades because I don't care about them. That those are things that was done. In the past, that when people come see you, they want to see you right now. Mm-hmm. But for somebody to say, and this is a new, this is a new guy. <clears throat> this is a new guy, and that's how I think about these youngsters. You do something on Instagram or YouTube and whatever. You got four or five years in the game, and you think that you're the same as me. Okay, I'll show you better than I can tell you. Yeah, you. What you want to do? You you want me to go first or you want to go first? Because you can go first and do an hour. I come out and do one story and people forget that you was there. That's just, just it's like if somebody tell me that L.A. comics are better than Houston comics or New York comics are better than Houston comics. And I'd be like, really, what? And, and this, it, all it takes is me to hear it and disagree with him. Like, well, well, let's see. If you, if, man, if you challenge me in a basketball game and you think in your mind that I can't play because I'm five seven, okay. The if you block, if you block my three pointer, I want to see that shit. Mm-hmm. Anything, if you like, I see these gloves up there. Anybody challenge me in that ring, they gon' they gonna have a problem. We're gonna throw some hands with them. They so gonna have. A let problem. me ask you. So you're a pre- pretty competitive guy. Yes. Um, you're a pretty competitive guy. For my um, athlete, for a soccer player, ball player, I used to play ball. Um, you, it almost sounds like you use the negativity and turn it into a positive. Yeah, yeah. I, you, I misplace that energy. I yes. take that energy and place it in the right it's, space. It's you've seen, uh, you've seen the Last Dance with Michael Jordan. That mm-hmm. whole, the whole document. Yeah. Uh, remember the, remember the time when uh, his old point guard B.J. Armstrong, they beat him one game. He was playing with Charlotte, I believe, at the time. Yeah. And he got the best of Michael Jordan. B.J. Armstrong, who was. Nice little player, nice little point guard. Nowhere near a Hall of Fame type career. They beat the Bulls in game one. And he kind of he, he kind of gave a little, you know, a little what's up to, to Jordan at the end. And Jordan, and he did this numerous times, he told himself a story that BJ said, I'm better than you. BJ Armstrong never said that. But Michael Jordan told everybody, yeah, BJ Armstrong thinks he's better than me. I'm going to show him. And then proceeded to destroy him. Jordan would make up stories to get to drive him nuts to feed the madness because he was someone that was motivated by madness. And essentially, he would take that madness and take that negativity and turn it into a positivity. Essentially, the same thing you're saying. You're not going to be a good father. I'll see you again soon. I'm better than you. I'll show you. Just wait and see. That's how I'm kind of hearing what you're saying. 
Yeah, what I, is, I I totally understand, Mike. In the like, I understand. Co- I understand any competitor mm-hmm. because you put things in your own head to to. You could have said somebody could said could have said nice set to me one time. <laughs> I'll never get to do that. Man, you had a nice set, and in my mind, I took that shit all the way. Like, what? 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 Yeah. Like, man, who are you talking to? And. <laughs> We still have we we have another show. We have another show, and he's hosting. And then the who's I'm not gonna say who's headlining, but the headliner said, "Why you say that?" And he said, "Why well, I just told him he had a nice set." Oh, now you just made this shit hard for me, because he's now he's gonna go out, and and I did. I went out. And I got a stand ovation the next set. And I'm like, yeah, that was that was a nice set, wasn't it? Like, 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 my, my. What, what, was it? Was it? He's like, like, what, it's, did it's, he not even a, it's not even that people make him angry. It's that it's that even if you give him a compliment, he will twist it. Got it. So and, that he can what, use it, just like Jordan. But it's like he said it with some like like it was unusual. Like <laughs> like I was out there doing that's like you. That's your competitive mind. <laughs> that's like, you. That's you. You said what? Like it's unusual. You know like, what you did? You did the whole. You did the whole. Uh, baby, you look great today. Oh, just today. Yes. That's what you did. Yes. That's what you oh, did to today? this poor dude. Oh, so it's today. <laughs> what's what's what is it about today? You know what I mean? <laughs> is it the what? Is it the weather? Yeah. What what's is today? It? Oh, I washed my face today like no other day. Yeah. Like a, <laughs> man, what made this one nice, Mister Host? <laughs> what was it about this one? That got you going, really. Like I come out. That's that's something like, that I can see a basketball player to do it too. He comes out of out of a game. Hey man, you had a great game, and you surprised. You it's know like, what I mean? just right. imagine if you say that to Jordan. Jordan, like, what you mean? What are you talking about? <laughs> it, but Good it's the same. Like, I'm, and I, it's not just me. I, I run right. So on the track, it's this lady. This is one white lady. It's like every time I see her ponytail, it just <laughs> it gets it gets me going. What? And so, because the what? way she the way she run, it's like she run with this authority, like she a bad motherfucker. And I'm and I'm and I'm like okay, because on the, on the track, this is what I do when I'm running on the on the track. So I know I'm gonna do like three or four miles, and these people that's on this track are not running against me. They not run, they don't even know I'm out here, but I get in this mode like you in front of me, and I just I I don't give you a half a mile from me. I got to catch you. I'm like I'm gonna run. Her ass down. And, <laughs> I just lapped her twice. And, Let me run her down. This white lady, I ran past her, and all I did was this. I ran past, and I just threw the peace sign. And <laughs> She's on a treadmill? No, she's on a track. She's on okay, a, gotcha. On a, she's gotcha. on a public track that we're is not outside. competitive at all. Minding her own for no, yeah, she's Mind just her running. own business. I run fast. <laughs> I, just throw, yeah. I just throw the peace sign to her, right? And I tell you, and I, I hit the corner, and I'm gone. I'm literally gone. Yeah. That's the first mile. First mile. By the second mile, this lady has ran past me and she threw up. She threw the deuces your way. And that lady, I didn't see her no more. Like she, (laughs) when I was done on the side, I did like four miles. I'm on the side and she, she did, she does like two more miles. I see this lady, she do two more miles and she comes by me, by my truck. She said, I'm glad you decided to throw up the peace sign, cause that pissed me off. Hell yeah! Like <laughs> she's doing, she needs the same fuel to the fire like you. And she said, and she said you ran past me, and I said, does he know that I run marathons for oh. a, like in her own mind? Oh. Like, does he know I run marathons? Oh, like and she does. And I said the next time I saw that lady, she was Houston had a like a five k. Or something they was running and she was coming through the ribbon with a she's like oh no like, she won oh, it i was like damn that's, that's what's from, called playing with the wrong person she said, she that's said. playing the wrong person it, but it see but the thing is it's not just me yeah no it's, i this this is not supposed to make anybody mad this is the peace sign yeah <laughs> but there, said, there's some context she, there it is said, i'm out fuck? you're she still said, in you it you gave me the peace let sign, me ask you and i took that personally I, what motivates you bro because i don't think your same motivation as him i don't think that your motivation is similar to his, is it? Um, no, I, I'm more I'm motivated by like my mom. You know what I mean? Like the 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 aggressive 
energy of like a immigrant parent is mm-hmm. kind of what drives me. I think. What's the difference? Um, I think that you know, your like I think everybody's driven by probably by that. You know, he's talking about kind of his mental operating state, which is a little you different. You got an immigrant mother who only believe every immigrant only believes in traditional jobs. Right. 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 So you're doing anything outside mm-hmm. of a traditional job. Right. You're wasting your time. Trade you're going it, yeah. to be like, what is what is this? What is this thing yeah, you're doing? Yeah, like the Indian parent, the complex, yeah. or the Asian parent. They want them to be a doctor. They want them to be a scientist, what have you. No, I want to be a comedian. Right. And, so and you, every parent wants that. And but. you motivate it right. by the... The image of you succeeding in something non-traditional right. and being successful in it, it's the same exact motivation. For sure. You think my mother... What are those you think, four motivators Pat always talks about? You, you have think, that? Can you pull that up? You think my mother... <laughs> my mother never thought that comedy was the way. For right. me. Like, ne- and and when I tell people this, and people think that it's... That it's that, ah, that you can't believe that. I'm like... I never got any support from anybody around me. Right. Because everybody thought that it should be something else. I should be doing something else. So just think of now how that fueled me to, like, just think, I live in Houston. People told me I had to move to L.A. or New York to be right. successful. Right. So it's So it's just more fuel. Oh, you got to get out of here. Like, man, who... Are y'all talking to? Like you talking to a person that you? Th- oh, you think I'm regular? So because right, right. other people couldn't do it, I can't do it. Right. Are you losing your goddamn mind? <laughs> like that's my. It's the thought. It's the same. My mother and everybody who I know, you cannot find one person that said we thought it was gonna do it. You know who who thought I could do it? A guy named Rick that was in <laughs> when I was in prison. <laughs> 